Hello, and welcome back to the workbench. Today I noticed something kind of odd with my 3D printing spools of filament. And this happens with all the PLA, not just this one. It's more pronounced with anything listed as uh, any of the cheap PLAs, because if you read this natural one kilogram. So there probably isn't a whole lot of other compound that goes into the inexpensive filaments. It's probably just straight PLA spooled up. So what ends up happening is, once these are spooled up, there's tension on this and it wants to stay spooled like this. What I noticed is when I leave filament running through the Bowden tube, or the PTFE tube on the back of the Prusa I3 Mark III with the multi-material extruder, it tends to get super brittle. So what I did is I took a piece off that was running in the tube initially for a while. I also ran one in a piece of PTFE and left it in the vise overnight. And then this was just held straight and it already snapped in half and broke a piece off, as you can see. I left it sitting straight. I just put it under a couple of weights to hold it in place. What I noticed is when I leave the PLA in the tube overnight, generally, and when I come back in the morning, it snaps like that. So... I held the one straight, and let's see, all right, that side's fine, but yeah, where it was held straight for the night, that's snapping, and this I haven't actually taken out yet, so let's see, yeah, see, it'll do stuff like that when you're trying to print with it, which is not great. It's funny, it actually looks like the PTFE shielded a bit, so there might be some moisture going on there as well, although I doubt it, because... Here's the filament roll, and this has been sitting out for a couple of months while I've been using it, and this is still very firm. As you can see, I can't actually break that at all. It's just flexing like plastic, like you'd expect plastic to, and doesn't doesn't break, doesn't get fragile. So the filament itself is just fine. It's only when I leave it sitting in the Bowden tube straightened that it comes up with the problem, and I'm fairly confident that it's because it's straightened because it's being held out of its round that it's that it's snapping like that uh, I don't think it has anything to do with moisture especially since the moisture in my workshop is controlled with a dehumidifier that that kicks on actually just kicked on in the background now if you hear that and I, I don't think that's have any problem with that because this has been sitting outside of a bag for a solid year while I've been using it uh, 2018 04 too. Yeah, so about a year while I've been using it, and I've had no problem whatsoever, aside from if I leave a piece of it straight in the Bowden tube going to the Mark III. So, if you're printing with straight PLA that doesn't have a lot of modifier, and probably even if you are printing with PLA Plus or some kind of heavily modified PLA, it doesn't really matter. I, I also print with that, and if I leave it in the Bowden tube long enough for a, half a month, say, that also gets brittle and just snaps when I go to use it. And then I have to go realize the printer's printing in air. I have to go back, clean it out. It's not really great. So the end of the story is if you're using PLA, make sure that you take it out of the tube when you're going to leave it sit. With this stuff, even if you're leaving it sit for an hour or two, it's fine. There's no problem with using it. And the prints themselves come out just fine. There's no there's no problem with the PLA. It works great. Once it's printed, it works fine. There's no there's no problem with this stuff at all. I've I've had some of the prints I've done with this around for almost a year now. One of the one of the spudgers I use regularly in the videos is printed out of that. So I haven't had any problem with this stuff at all since I started using it. And I, I this is the second spool I've gone through now. Um, now that I've had this in the shop, and uh, it's been great. With the exception that if you leave it tense straight like that for a long period of time, a few hours or so, while it's not in use and running, it gets very brittle and snaps like that. So, if you want to prevent that, just take the spool off the uh, Bowden tube. Just make sure that the filament isn't being held straight by something, and that it's nicely wound around its spool, and you shouldn't have any problem. I mean, of course you could still get a problem with moisture happening, but that would be completely different in a moisture-controlled environment or low-moisture environment. That's that's certainly not what would be happening. It would be more like this, where it's it's from the tension of being held straight, and then when it returns to its 
wrapped form, or even not, if it's just held straight over the log, and then you go to print with it, it just shatters like that. So, there you are. Try not to do that. It'll probably save you some PLA in the long run. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video or found it informative, please subscribe down below and give me a thumbs up. See you next time.